Hello and welcome back. In this video, a quick and easy fix for a slightly underexposed grey day photo. Before we start, let's have a look at the end result. Pretty awesome. Keep in mind, this works well for images that don't have any blown out highlights. So let's go. I will remove the effect group and start from scratch. First step is to duplicate your image. We will apply some adjustments to this copy. So let's create a group with this duplicate. As we are going to increase the highlights, the blend mode of this group will need to be set to add. Now the adjustments. We just need two curves adjustments. After I add the first one, I will duplicate it to create a second one. Perfect, we now got a very bright image. Time to tune the adjustments. First thing we need to do is set the blend mode of the top curves adjustment to linear burn. This will bring back a lot of the details and the color. However, it is still too bright. This is why we have a second curves adjustment on top of the image. Let's open that up. Now what we need to do is to drop down the highlights about to 60 to 70 percent. This fixes the overblown whites, but we still need to bring back the overall highlights. We can do this by adding a second control point close to the right control point and move that up a bit. Usually the last part of the curve is flat, but you need to experiment depending on your image. And we're done. Let's compare the before and the after. Pretty amazing, right? I will paste on another image and repeat the same steps. As mentioned earlier, this effect works very well with slightly underexposed images. So here are the steps again. Duplicate the image, make a group with the duplicate, add two curves adjustments to the group, And don't forget to set the blend mode of the group to add and the blend mode of the top curves adjustment to linear burn. As a final step, control and adjust the effect with the lower curves adjustment. Awesome! I will apply the same effect to two more images in super speed so we can see how the effect works. In the last image, I will set the blend mode of the lower curves adjustment to luminosity. Depending on your image, the luminosity blend mode might work better. Also, keep in mind that this effect can be easily masked out. Just add a mask to the group and remove it from the areas where you don't want this to be applied. For example, on some bright areas that get overblown. As a final tip, you can also adjust the blend range of the group, especially if your dark areas start getting muddy. And of course, with the opacity, you can control the strength of the effect. I hope you like this technique and thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. Keep safe and keep being creative. Until the next video.